This is literally mind over matter, moving this electronic hand by the power of brainwaves alone. And while it not only looks impressive, this is hopefully the first step towards a massive breakthrough for people who have been left paralysed. Researchers in Japan have been working on new technology that will open up a whole new virtual reality world for people who are normally locked away in their own. Volunteer student Yasunari Hashimoto has been testing the equipment for the last two months by taking a virtual stroll through the historical city of Kyoto without moving a muscle. These electrodes placed around his head means that just by thinking about turning left, it means the icon also goes left. Using the online community of Second Life, a game which replicates life in the real world, they hope patients will be able to walk streets, set up their own businesses, and send emails between other members online, all through the power of thought. The project, still in its early days, is not the first time that cognitive computer control has been investigated. Teams in the US have been experimenting with implants in the brain, which can move objects like wheelchairs and eventually create cybernetic body parts that can be moved by brain power alone. But this team in Japan are hoping that this project will open up more of a social world for those who've been left paralysed and wave hello to the possibility of shopping and chatting on the internet.